Hey, it's Monica. I usually love taking road trips. We originally planned to go to South Padre Island in Southern Texas. It's the day before vacation. I'm so excited. I'm like a kid before a school field trip the next day. I can't sleep. It's vacation day. South Padre bound. <laughs> I've been driving in the rain for 12 hours straight. I don't know what the sun looks like anymore. Everything really is bigger in Texas. No joke, it rained the entire time I drove down there. It was a 20 hour drive, which I drove the entire way there. 20 hour drive, it didn't stop raining. So we decided to try and make the best of it. Surely it has to clear up sometime. D aren't beaches usually something like it's gonna rain for 10 minutes and it'll clear up the rest of the day? Wrong. We tried to make the best of it for the first day at least. <laughs> Said, tried to have fun the first day, but the second day, it was so cold. It was warmer in Evansville, and it wasn't fun. What happens when false advertising happens? They say this beach is a lot of fun. There's nobody on the beach, and I'm cold. What do you do when you go on vacation and it sucks? You leave and you go somewhere else better. So we got out of our hotel and we left. We just went to New Orleans. Joe from South Padre, Texas went up to New Orleans. Did you think the road trip was over then? It wasn't. We then headed up to Chicago. And while we were in Chicago, we went up to Medieval Times. Hey, I've been all over the country so far, and now I'm traveling back in time. It's Medieval Times. Overall, during my week-long road trip, I traveled a total of 3,282 miles. My little Hyundai Santa Fe can do a lot. <laughs>